This new audio model from Step Fun comes with a breakthrough. In this video, not only I am going to unpack that breakthrough in simple yet technical language, we are also going to install it locally and we are going to test it out. This is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. Please like the video and subscribe and consider becoming a member as that keeps the lights on the channel and I would be very, very grateful. Also, please follow me on X. If you're looking for AI updates without any fluff and hype, plus few more tidbits from across the globe. Okay, having said that, now first let's try to unpack what this model is. So this represents a breakthrough in audio language modeling as the first ever model to successfully implement chain of thought reasoning for audio tasks. Let's get the installation underway and we will be talking more about what exactly that means. I'm going to use this Ubuntu system. I have one GPU card, NVIDIA RTX A6000 with 48 GB of VRAM. On their repo, they mention they have tested it out on 80 GB VRAM H100. But let's try it out on 48 GB to see how it goes. I am going to create a virtual environment. And if you're looking to rent a GPU, whether it is A6000 or H100 or various other, you can find the link to Mast Compute in video's description with a discount coupon code of 50% for a range of GPUs. So please do check them out and virtual environment is created. Now the good thing is that Step Fund has provided a Docker image to run this model locally. I'm going to use that. So for that, you need to make sure that you have a Docker latest version install. I already have that. If you don't know how to do that, just search my channel. So I'm going to use Docker with it. And this is a command which you need to run in order to pull that image and run on your local system. So let's run this. And once you run it, it downloads a lot of stuff and this is going to take a bit of a time. So while that happens, let's talk about this model as what exactly is cooking here. So unlike previous models, including the Step Fun's own model in audio format, which we already have covered on the channel, this um, and the previous models suffered from inverted scaling where performance degraded with longer reasoning. And that is what they are trying to solve. So this one uses extended deliberation to enhance performance. The model's core innovation is the modality grounded reasoning distillation or MGRD framework, which addresses a fundamental issue where models were performing textual surrogate reasoning, which means analyzing transcripts rather than actual audio due to modality mismatch. So by shifting the reasoning process from textual abstractions to genuine acoustic properties, this step audio R1 achieves superior performance and it has even surpassed Gemini 2.5 Pro, matching Gemini 3 across major audio reasoning tasks and the accuracy is around 96%. But most importantly, I think this architecture is what makes it unique. If you look here, this one is using an iterative training approach with two main iterations, each incorporating that MGRD, which again, modality grounded reasoning distillation. The model processes dual inputs, textual queries as tokenized through a text tokenizer, while audio signals undergo encoding and adaptation to generate audio features. During reasoning, the model generates both semantic text thinking and acoustic text thinking components, which creates reasoning chains that are genuinely grounded in acoustic features rather than hallucinated or disconnected deliberation. And that is the secret sauce here. And I just checked, it is still downloading everything. This is going to take a bit of a time as I mentioned earlier. So carrying on this one, now, this multimodal fusion allows the model to maintain focus on audio specific characteristics while performing complex reasoning tasks across speech, environment, sound, and music. And this whole iterative training process gradually refines the model's ability to generate audio relevant reasoning chains that effectively transforms extended deliberation from a liability into a powerful asset for audio intelligence. So that is what is happening inside this model. Uh, again, please follow me on X as that helps. Plus, 
please consider becoming a member as that helps a lot and now it is downloading the model there are seven shards of it so let's wait for it to get downloaded okay eventually the model is running on our local host at port 7860 so let me access it there and this is what it looks like let me now upload an audio and then we will see how it works you can also record it from your microphone if you like but i'm just going to upload an audio from my local system i'm just going to go here and then i think i have few of the audios let's go with maybe code one first let me also play it for you Create a self-contained HTML file using p5.js that features a colorful, animated so I have started rocket, to... zooming dynamically across the screen in random directions. The rocket should leave behind a trail of sparkling fireworks that burst into vibrant, radiating particles. Okay, so you see this was a prompt, but it is not running. I think it just uh, ran out of memory. And if you check the logs, you can see that it is complaining about a uh, single gpu node because i have given it all the you know i haven't specified any gpus but by default it seems that a docker which they have shared is looking for a multi gpu node let me now re try to rerun it with single gpu okay so it is not even running um when i passed it one gpu so what i'm going to do i'm just going to quickly test it out on h100 with 80 gp of vram if that works or not same set of instructions so let me quickly spin up a new vm and show it to you there so i have spun up another server as you can see h100 with 80 gp of vram now let's run it and see if it is able to uh, run now and this event doesn't work on h100 it needs at least four gpus i have gone into their docker container and it asks for four gpus can you imagine that an audio model um the seven shards so i think uh, anyway i will test it out on their hosted platform but i don't think so this is something which is for the mere bottles like us and especially when there are so many choice so much choice available in audio i think they are just living in some la la land anyway let's go and test it out um on some hosted platform so this is a hosted platform i will drop the link in video's description let me grab a file from my local system i'm just going to go with the same one where i am asking it a question which i already played it for you it is uploading let me send it and then it takes a bit of a time let's wait and you can see that it is now queued so let's wait for it to come back so all i'm asking it to reason through this prompt where i'm asking it to provide a code so let's wait for it to come back so it has come back and it is processing the request unfortunately this is a breakthrough this is what it makes it different but you can't even see the trace of thinking as what exactly it is thinking how it is uh, dividing the problem producing the chain of thought doesn't really show anything here anyway i will let it finish and then i'll show you exactly what it produces and it has doing started doing something i'll just show you there is some you know thinking but i can't really see it there's a lot of thinking actually and the model is 33 billion do we need that much uh those that much those you know that much parameters for audio i don't think so anyway so let's see so it is the thinking looks quite good no doubt about that but taking long time to think and produce the answer there you go yep it is producing some code here and i will i will let it produce the code and then it is still yep so it is writing the code so i will let it produce the code and i will if it is complete i will run it in the browser okay so it has uh, not completed the whole code production it just finished here but the code looks okay it's not earth shattering to be honest i have gone through 
it uh, in quite detail instead of boring you with it so look um, i think the model looks okay but i think things have moved so far up like a 33 billion parameter model for just audio modality i don't think so that is on um, they should do better chain of thought is good but that can be done in fewer parameters anyway let me know what do you think about it again please like the video and subscribe and consider becoming a member as that helps a lot thank you for all the support